right, welcome to True Stealth's gaming channel, where I'm going to play uh, Blaze Blue Cross Tag Battle Episode Blaze Blue, and continuing off where I was before. This is gonna be the third episode in the series, and wait, oh man, it's gonna be confusing with the episodes and episode. Well, I guess one episode is word. That's how you know it's the Cross Tag episode. One episode is number, and that's how you know it's my actual series. Yeah, so it's gonna be third episode where we're talking. We're doing episode Blaze Blue, second chapter. Last time we left off, we Rachel just left, and we were shown that we're getting a rotating cast, where every single, I guess, chapter, there's going to be someone new coming in because something or another happens with noelle it was because she actually had a way that could probably help us get out of here rachel knowing something or another decided that ragna was probably the best choice and just let him keep the keystone which we're trying to take over to a uh, somewhere and do something with no we aren't really sure exactly what's going on we just know the fact that we got to fight a lot of people and they want to get the keystone so they can go back home and we just want to go back home. And that seems to be really all that matters. Last episode, we went up against Linne and Waldstein from Undernight in Birth series. And I don't know who we're going up against here. I'm guessing they'll, well actually, considering the fact that each episode is there we might be seeing like maybe four to five chapters in each episode where it phase off against other groups so for here we're playing as actually we face ourselves too so yeah so here we're, we're playing as the blaze blue universe with ragna being the main protagonist and we fought off against the other night in birth universe where i believe well, I guess Linnae's a major person, not really sure. Um, we even fought against our shadow cells of Ragnar Noel. So next, uh, it could either be Ruby or Persona 4. I'm guessing with this background, we're probably gonna see something closer to Ruby, but I've talked enough. Let's go ahead and get back into the actual game seems like the scenery changes every few steps. Oh, jeez. She could have at least told me where the goal is. Hey, you plan on following me forever? Is Makoto? Ah, you got me. Nope. You're pretty sharp, ain't ya? Yes. Wait, who? But yeah, oh, Gordon. Sorry. You were having such an interesting conversation that I couldn't help but follow you for a bit. I don't know who you are or where you're from, but what do you want? Could Wait a second. This? He's not ah, so this you. is it, huh? You're a lucky one. It'd make things simple if you could just give it to me, but that's not gonna happen, is it? <laughs> if I'm correct, Gorgie should be from Iron Knight Ember. So my theory about us facing different franchises this place is interesting but i don't intend to spend the rest of my life here you know which puts me in a bit of a predicament i'd rather not have to play rough with people from other worlds wait a minute other worlds what you didn't pick up on that this place is filled with people from several different worlds I doubt you and I are from the same one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you're from Iron Knight. Seriously? What makes you so sure? Call it intuition. You've got an unfamiliar sort of power to you. You're clearly not an ordinary human, but you're not an inbirth either. Yep, he's from Iron Knight. An inbirth? <laughs> <Ugh. laughs> 
Yeah, I guess it is kind of weird. But I like the little animations they have with the actual characters. For example, he saw that Rogan's eyes are like, what? I haven't heard the term, huh? Well, in that case, what do you call your powers? Uh, Armagus? The Azure? Mm -hmm. Drive? Whoa, guys, look, we're going back to the Blaze Blue games. I, the Zur, I love that one. Uh, Drive was pretty popular too. Oh, uh, I just. Like that. <laughs> yeah, seems like it's more than just a difference in vocabulary. Hope I'll get a chance to see those skills in action. Wait, 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 wait. We need our person. Are you about to tell me that we group up with people outside of Lazo as well? If so, this is going to be a much wilder story than I expected. It doesn't sound like you're playing dumb. <laughs> now things are getting really complicated. I'll say. But the people from the other worlds aren't what's bothering me. It's that voice. There's something shady about her. I get the feeling that holding a tournament here isn't her main goal. Yep. I get that feeling too. Uh, mostly from the prologue. And also the fact that her consistency is barely anything. But let's figure out what it is. Yeah. Which means she's up to something. And using the tournament as a front. Yeah. If you know all that, why were you following me? That blonde girl you were talking to earlier seemed way more informed than I am. Given how casually you were talking to her, I figured you might know some stuff too. I just chose the more approachable of the two of you. I see. Well, you chose wrong. Wish I could help, but I don't know anything. And she's... <sighs> Rachel's always like that. She tells people what to do, but doesn't give them the reasons why until the very end. Oh. Are you telling me she can't be trusted? Uh, she can't be. Well... No. She's always got a plan. That's just the way she is. I see. Which means it won't be easy to get her to talk. Okay. I doubt the dialogue actually does anything. But it seems like a nice touch. <laughs> Something wrong? No. Just thought I sensed bloodlust. Bloodlust? Must be your imagination. Wait, did I just hear like Okay, crispy? I take that back. Dang it! Our ambush failed! <laughs> For some reason that's just way too funny. Ruby trying to ambush someone. <laughs> Oh gosh, so who is she with? I'm guessing Yang, since I can't imagine anyone else thinking that was a good idea. Stay focused. It's not over yet. What? Blake? You actually let her attempt to ambush? Ah, oh, I thought that's smarter of you. Who are these girls? Hi, how do you do? I'm Ruby. Oh, and uh, this is Blake. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Aw, how cordial. Same bag is sent packing real quick. Hey, Ruby, that's great and all, but. But introductions are important! You've got to make sure your relationships start out on the right foot! And yes, so I'm actually going to stop this episode right before we get into the fights and let the fight continue in the next episode depends on what kind of relationship you want to have really so tell me what kind of relationship were you looking for when you attacked us out of nowhere i 
think they made that clear enough. They weren't playing around with that attack. Nobody would do something like that if they weren't looking for a fight. enthusiasm just carefree attitude it's great to see Wait, huh I just really want to see those weapons in action please you have the keystone don't you give it to us now like don't lose your composure like looks that. like our next challengers are these two lovely girls and they're going up against two big grumpy men let's see how these physical differences play out <laughs> oh boy. This announcer is something else. Every eye in the stadium is glued to these contenders. So, let the match begin! Stop shoving us into random matches already. Just let it go. If she cared about our complaints, we'd never have to fight. So true. I'm not exactly on your side, but we can be partners for now. Fine. Just don't drag me down, Black Scythe bastard. Not a fan of that nickname. Call me Gordo. I'm Ragna. Let's do this. Get ready. Uh. I'm Get gonna go Gordo ready. first. Gordo first, just because I really don't know either of them. But hearing the intros, she can't escape yeah, there's no crossing intros, fate. Unfortunately, yeah. But uh, Gordo is aside from you, someone who's actually one of the, uh, really considered very strong with like oh. It's, uh, <laughs> They'd be like, wait a second. Blake! But Blake's range is higher. Why did she use it? Because her things are weird. Wait, what? How is that the best decision? Wait, what? Okay, so... I lost. Wait, oh no. That was not good, but. The fact that she's just winning so hard. This is what happens when I get two characters I don't use. I, I can't play the game. Get ready! I. Like, I really don't even know how Gordo's sight works. I thought it was on his regular attack, like Blake, but apparently. Oh, it's not there. Okay. Yeah, and also the blue aura means that he uh, can't switch it up. What? I really thought it's different. Oh well. Alright. What? She grabbed me again? If I could at least use Mia, I would feel Or Noelle, or clearly. Oh my She was literally in hit stun. The fact that she was actually able to do that. Thing. 
Okay, there we go. Oh, that was nice. That was nice. The fact that I was actually able to push her back and damage her. Satisfied now? Before Blake's uh, partner assist came in was excellent. Oh, Ruby, your enthusiasm is the best. <laughs> like how, like even though she just lost, she's just way too excited about the weapons to even care about it. Wait, no, I, I. This girl's an odd one. Ruby, let's fall back for now. Huh? But I wanted to talk a little more. Hey, you guys! If you're gonna be my enemy, then I won't hold back. We'll remember that. But we're totally gonna win next time. And when that happens, I'm gonna make you show me everything your weapon can do. Oh my. I mean, to be fair, you won the first time. Uh, but that's not exactly a comforting statement. And they're gone. That girl needs to calm down. I think I'll be on my way too. It's been a fun little chat, but I can't hang around here forever. Besides, I've got some more investigation to do. And since I don't have the keystone, I don't think I'm going to run into much trouble. <laughs> Look at him. Being smart. If we run into each other again, let's trade some information. Sounds good to me. Just don't get your ass kicked before then. Likewise. Watch your back. Oh, just see chapter three. Uh, the scenery changed again. All right. So with that, we've reached a new chapter in the episode, and therefore we're going to be ending the video. I hope you guys enjoyed that last chapter. Uh, and I really don't plan to make a lose win the standard uh, and once i get closer to people i use more i expect not to be like that like once you get to the ruby stage right if you have ruby as the main character and i can use her every fight you, you should you can already expect for much better stuff but even still i think i did fairly decent uh, i hope you enjoyed if you did Comment, say what you liked, or comment, say what you dis or you didn't like, like approve on, whatever. It's just nice interacts. And watch the next episode. Thanks for watching.